So this is the <clears throat> upcoming tablet um, coming out uh, in midsummer, and so it's a four by three aspect ratio. We think is good for um, you know holding the device. You don't have to lean this forward this way. And it's running Android. Uh, yeah, Honeycomb. Or? Running Gingerbread right now. We'll, we'll advance up to Honeycomb when uh, we feel that that product's stable enough. Okay. So there's been some problems with Honeycomb and some of the releases. So <clears throat> we're waiting for that to be stabilized a little bit better, and then we'll. Um, tr uh, transfer over-the-air updates for all of the existing products so we have complete over-the-air update capabilities on all, all these products etc <clears throat> two speakers at the top here that's a uh, and that's different I, I guess the, the <coughs> one thing that people will be attracted to Vizio right away is the price it's 350 yeah it's around 300 so the other thing we've done also is we've done a lot I mean Android's not very good at the UI stuff so you'll notice, and you look at the TVs and everything here, it's the same exact UI. And we spent a lot of time and effort on customizing the UI to make it really easy uh, for users to navigate through Android. And that's one of the things I think when we look at Honeycomb, they've made some UI improvements. It's a lot more cluttered. So we're doing a lot of work around that on the Honeycomb project as well to make the user interface much better. So um, this is just you know standard apps here. I have some downloaded some apps here. Obviously Angry Birds, etc. Yeah. Um, has two speakers at the top. When you rotate it this way, these speakers come into play here. So it's full rotation of uh, uh, you know the separation here. You cheated out a little bit. Oh yeah. The <clears throat> so um, these speakers provide good separation, great stereophonic sound. And that's it's really the unique. IPad doesn't do. Right. And that other iPad, iPad puts it down the bottom here. So when you're holding the device like this, yeah. you're covering the speakers. Especially if you have it on your belly. When you're yeah, exactly. Speakers, so. so this way, with the speakers in this orientation in the landscape mode, it really provides a lot better <coughs> um, stereophonic sound. Uh, and so it's real good for um, music listening. Obviously, we're going to do a lot of integration with the TVs, being able to transfer content. It's got HDMI out for uh, full HD uh, support. Then obviously micro USB for charging and other things like that. But we're really excited about it. Um, a lot of um, people that we've had with, with some of our partners and stuff are really excited about it as well. Yeah. It's a unique design. What, what's Again, the battery life going to be like on this? Uh, up to 10 hours. <coughs> um, now you do Walt, like. Walt Mossberg just this morning rated the Samsung tablet and said the battery life was subpar compared to the iPad. Yeah, and so really battery life is tough, right? Because it really depends on usage. Um, obviously, the specs we've developed for this is it has to be able to watch at least a full length video. Uh, or a movie. So, um, you know, but if you're doing a lot of video, a lot of surfing, maybe running multiple apps at the same time, syncing in the background, things like that, that's definitely going to have an impact on battery life. But um, we so have. What kind, of, how, what kind of processor does it have? So it has a one gigahertz processor. Okay. And we actually have a, the battery in this is uh, 6,100 milliamps. So it is a really powerful battery. If you look at some of our competitors' batteries there, we're about a third better than them in terms of just total power. So we should get great performance out of this. So, and, um, same similar kind of screen to an iPad. It looks a little darker. I, I, yeah, I mean, you can put Angry Birds up or something. Yeah, like sure. That looks <clears throat> right. I was just playing this a few minutes ago. Yeah. <laughs> so, so then now you have the stereophonic sound too in it. Yeah. So. Anyhow, so that's pretty much, this is, again, this is our first, we're right, right, trying to be really competitive in terms of price point, and this is, you know, a, a tablet for the masses, not necessarily just for the, the people that are, um, you know, bucks. yeah, at <laughs> five, six, seven hundred bucks, right, so. And I think my iPad costs eight hundred, nine hundred dollars. Yeah, you, you loaded it up, right? Yeah. So. Um, are you, are you guys thinking of using this as a controller for the big screen? So actually, great question. This, this has a, a remote control app on it, and it's a universal remote control. So it'll use it, not just Visio products, all of our products, oh, um, you know, and use your home theater, et cetera. So um, yeah, we have an IR blaster here. It covers about 95% of all CE products. So. Oh, that's built into the tablet? Yeah, it's an application, yep. Visio, uh, Visio application. Oh, but is there an IR yep, blaster? Yep, there's an IR blaster right here. Oh, that's something that the other tablets don't have. Yeah, right so yeah. Okay. Very so, cool. Yeah, you can. And what's great about a software-based remote control is that when you pair it to your device, it'll only show you the keys that are for that device, right? So, 
some devices may not have the certain keys. So it's not like a regular you know, remote you buy at Radio Shack that has 150 buttons on it. It only shows you the buttons that are applicable to that specific device. Yeah. So. Are, are you guys uh, going to develop your own sort of airplay uh, technology so you can watch a movie here on the tablet and then, <coughs> or a, like a TED video or something like mm -hmm. that? I go, oh, this is too long. I want to watch it on my big yeah. screen. Can Sh I click a button? Media shifting is absolutely part of our uh, our value prop, right? So being able to integrate everything is is yeah. more about the total entertainment uh, uh, environment in your home. So this, the tablet is not just a tablet; it's a tablet that works with all of our. Now that doesn't devices. do that yet. Does doesn't it? do that yet. Okay. No, but we, we will have. Because there's some technology coming out that people have asked me to introduce you guys to. Yeah. That'll let you do the AirPlay style technology right. on any TV on any uh, tablet yeah so that, right now you can use it as a player obviously right now with the HDMI video out so yeah but you know yeah, sorry <laughs> <laughs> the trick is to get rid of wires <laughs> yeah especially if you're sitting on your couch you're right. 10 feet away from your TV set you right. don't want to sit there and plug in a cord right. you know the kids will all bite it <laughs> um, anyhow so cool. yeah, this is the first look at it and uh, we're excited about it back with that yeah this is a just pretty nice. sample, yeah. Nicer than some of your com competitors, too. Yeah. yeah, we spent a lot of time on trying to design it. So we're aggressively going. This is the only the first tablet we have, so we'll launch the other ones in 2012. Very cool. Thank Super. you very much. Thanks.